I'm Chad Mills in Bartow, where a 22-year-old father is locked up, charged with killing his four-month-old daughter. Nicole, whose identity we've concealed, can't believe the news. It's devastating. It's absolutely heartbreaking. Officers say a 22-year-old man who lives in her Bartow neighborhood killed his four-month-old daughter. We're so close by. We're close with all of our neighbors, and you just wish that you could have intervened or done something, or if you knew their situation, if you could have helped in some way. According to Polk County Sheriff Grady Judd, it all started in late February when the 22-year-old Jacob Kubai was watching his daughter at home while his wife, the child's mom, was at work. So she's working two jobs, and Jacob's staying home with a baby. Judd says Kubai showed up at the hospital that night and said he found the baby unresponsive, but the sheriff says his deputies and Bartow police officers discovered inconsistencies with that explanation. He says they learned Kubai ran to Walmart, leaving the four-month-old at home. They also discovered injuries to the child that caused them to arrest Kubai. Our detectives said they counted a minimum of 10 strikes to the forehead. Did you hear that? The baby was beaten in the forehead at least by 10 different strikes. 10 ribs were fractured and they said they, that was, would have been from a squeezing of the child. The baby was literally beaten to death. And the only person that was home with the baby at the time was Jacob. The baby ultimately died at a Tampa hospital. Her dad now charged with a list of felonies, and the sheriff says he never showed remorse or offered an explanation. He started saying things like, none of this is real. My wife's not real. My baby's not real. Neighbor Nicole, meanwhile, offers this advice to other parents. Just always ask for help, um, even if you don't feel like maybe you need help, always just reach out. Um, someone is always willing to help or be there for you. By the way, the sheriff says investigators have no reason to believe the baby's mother participated in the abuse. In Bartow, Chad Mills, ABC Action News.